It's me, Blue Note, and welcome back to the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Here we go. Sorry, I missed about a week of uploads there, but uh, I had a lot on my plate. Not so much anymore. So, here we go. Hey, those two at it again? Come on now. This should be yeah. Keep your balance. Come on. Excuse me. Little blood to clear the air. Hope you have the stomach for it, outsider. Don't suppose I could uh, join the companions. So you think you have what it takes? Lucky for you, I'm not the one who makes that decision. Talk to Codlack. Who knows? Maybe he's in a generous mood. Okay. Watch the blades. our burden to bear but we can overcome you have my brother and I obviously but I don't know if the rest will go along quite so easily leave that to me wonder what that was all about oh well a stranger comes to our hall I would like to join the companions if I may would you now here let me have a look at you Yes, perhaps. A certain strength of spirit. Master, you're not truly considering accepting him. I am nobody's master, Vilkas. And last I checked, we had some empty beds in Yorvaskar for those with a fire burning in their hearts. Apologies. Thought perhaps this isn't the time. I've never even heard of this outside. Excuse me, I have slain Sometimes a dragon and saved your Gildergreen. Sometimes men and women come to us to seek their fame. It makes no difference. What matters is their heart. And their arm. Of course. How are you in battle, boy? Oh, I still have much to learn. That's the spirit. Vilkas here will get started on that. Vilkas, take him out to the yard and see what he can do. I... I haven't seen you before, have I? Have we met? I'm sorry, I forgot. What kind of weapon do you need? Someone there? Time to I end this new game. Yeah. Hopefully, this cutscene didn't catch. Not bad. Okay. Next time won't be so easy. You might just make it. But for now. You're still a whelp to us, new blood. So you do what we tell you. Here's my sword. Go take it up to Yorlin to have it sharpened. And be careful. It's probably worth more than you are. He's usually supposed to have dialogue before he draws a sword on me, but I guess he glitched out. It's to be expected, but oh well, we got through it unscathed. Sometimes when that happens, the entire guild turns on me and chases me out of White Run. What brings you here? Vilkas sent me with a sword. I'm guessing you're the newcomer. Then. <laughs> Does he always send the newcomers on errands? Oh, don't worry too much about it. They were all whelps once. They just might not like to talk about it. And don't always just do what you're told. Nobody rules anybody in the companions. Surely someone has to be in charge, though. Well, I'm not sure how they've managed it, but they have. No leader since Ysgrimor. Kodlak is the harbinger, and he's a sort of advisor for the whole group. But every man is his own, every woman her own. Are you a companion? Not actually a companion myself, but none of them know how to work a forge properly. 
and I'm honored to serve them. My name is Eorlin Greymane. I work the Skyforge. Best steel in all of Skyrim. All of Tamriel. Well, I guess I should be going. I have a favor to ask. What's up? I've been working on a shield for Aela. My wife is in mourning, and I need to get back to her soon. I'd be much obliged if you could take this to Aela for me. Sure, I'm happy to lend a hand. That's a good man. is a better talker than me. He should be around someplace. Excuse me. If Isgrimor himself wouldn't have the patience to deal with all the rabble around here. Apologies, milady. I am just here to deliver a shield. Ah, good. I've been waiting for this. Good to see you made it up here. You know this one? I saw him training in the yard with Vilkis. Ah, yes. I heard you gave him quite a thrashing. Don't let Vilkis catch you saying that. Do you think you could handle Vilkis in a real fight? I really don't care for boasting. Ah, a man of action. Here, let's have Farkas show you where you'll be resting your head. Farkas. Did you call me? Of course we did, Icebrain. Show this new blood where the rest of the whelps sleep. New blood? Oh, I remember you. Come on, follow me. One day when you and I are on the circle, we can change how things are run around. Skior and Ayala like to tease me. But they're good people. They challenge us to be our best. I know. Young warrior. Nice to have a new face around. It gets boring here sometimes. I hope we keep you. This can be a rough life. The quarters are up here. Just pick a bed and fall in it when you're tired. Tilma will keep the place clean. She always has. All right, so here you are. Looks like the others are eager to meet you. Come to me or Ayala if you're looking for work. Once you've made a bit of a name for yourself, Skior and Vilkas might have things for you to do. Good luck. Welcome to the Companions. By the way, if you're looking for something to do, we've got trouble right here in Whiterun Hold. Nothing we can't handle. What sort of trouble? It's a problem with the Forsworn. Unpredictable, unknowable, and dangerous. Be careful. Forsworn? In Whiterun? Yeah, okay, I'll take care of it. Good. Do not spare them your blade. By the way, if you're looking for something to do... Serpent's Bluff Redoubt. Hmm. Interesting. Forsworn are a faction of half Breton, half Nord folk who typically hang around. Oh, what's the name of that region? Not the Reach, but, uh. uh the area around Markarf that, uh. It borders Skyrim and High Rock, the native land of Bretons. Let me. Take a peek at the map and see where that... Oh, my. Yeah. Yeah, it's closer to Markarf than it is to Whiterun. Hmm. Okay. I've got a different idea. We'll put that quest on hold and do something a little closer to base for now. I work with my mother. So Courier? Nope. Sorry. Oh, okay then. Yes. How's it going? Who are you looking for? A woman. A foreigner in these lands. Redguard like us. 
she is likely not using her true name. We will pay for any information regarding her location. We are not welcome here in Whitehall, so we will be in Rorikstead if you learn anything. Why are you looking for this person? It's none of your concern. All you need to know is that we're paying for information. If that doesn't interest you, feel free to walk away. Okay, just remind me who you're looking for. We're looking for a fugitive who comes from Hammerfell. A Redguard woman. She may be somewhere in this city. Hmm, Redguard woman. If well, there's located, several of them in this state. city. Nope. Uh, Sorry. No. I I'm gonna head to the tavern and get a drink to think this over and figure out who they might be looking for. Anything, or take a seat by the fire, and I'll send someone over. Uh, oh, there once was a hero named Ragnar the Red who came riding to White Run from old. Why can't I sit on this bench? Whatever. And the braggart did swagger and brandish his blades. Uh, 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 there we go. But then he went quiet. Sadia, when he met the shield, yes. Oops, much sorry, I didn't mean to bump the mic. Oh, you talk. You want a drink? You drink all of me. Now I think it's high time. Uh, hey, you're a red guard woman. I heard a rumor that some Alakir warriors are looking for a red guard woman. Are you sure? Oh no. They found me? I need your help, please. Come with me. I need to speak to you privately. As you say. Quickly, come with me. Working with them? You think you can take me? You so much as touch me and you're going to lose fingers. I mean it. I'll I'll cut you in half. So the Alakir know where I am? What did they offer you? Gold? This is How many more of them are coming? Staunch protector. Okay, um I just slew a dragon outside the city gates. You might want to put that down. I'm sorry, just just don't hurt me. I know you're not one of them, but you just can't help them. You can't let them know I'm here. Please, will you help me? There's no one here I can trust. Uh, maybe. What do you want? I am not the person that the people of Whiterun think I am. My real name is Eamon. I am a noble of House Suda in Hammerfell. The men who are looking for me, the Alakir, they are assassins in the employ of the Almarie Dominion. They wish to exchange my blood for gold. I need you to root them out and drive them away before they find me and drag me back to Hammerfell for an execution. How am I supposed to get rid of them? They're mercenaries, only in it for the money. They're led by a man named Kamatu. Get rid of him, and the rest will scatter. I don't dare show my face, lest they recognize me, so you'll have to find out where they are. Any suggestions as to how I can find them? I heard one of them was just arrested trying to sneak into the city. If he's locked up in the jail, perhaps you can get it out of him. Please, I know I'm asking you to do something difficult, maybe even dangerous. I just don't know who else I can trust. <sighs> Alright, I'll see what I can do. Find me the moment the Alakir are taken care of. This quest is likely going to take us out near Rorikstad, which is closer to Markarf than Whiteman and closer to our next goal with the Companions, so it all works out. All I gotta do now is head to the Whiterun dungeons and get some information out of that prisoner. I have enough gold, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Like I said, it's been a week since I last played this game, so my memory is a little fuzzy.
Hey. What are you looking at? I need to find Kamatu. Where is he hiding? You have a death wish then? If you know that name, you must know to meet him would be to meet your end. But it seems we both have needs, friend. Perhaps we can help each other out. What are you after? I have dishonored my brothers by being captured. So they have left me here. My life with the Alakir is over now. But I have no wish to die in this god's forsaken land. If I can be released from prison, I may start over. See to that, and I'll tell you what you want to know. Hmm. How much to pay your fine? One hundred gold will secure my release. You can afford that, can't you? I suppose you'd better hope you can, if you want the information. Get the money into the hands of one of these guards, and I'll tell you what you want to know. Well enough. I'll be right back. Mm-hmm. Hey. You're heading east, steer clear of Hillgrunt's tomb. Thing about those old crypts, the dead having trouble staying that way. I'll keep that in mind, but first and foremost, I need to pay that prisoner's fine. Done. Convince him to stay out of the city while you're at it. Hey, get back over here. Trouble? Let's talk about how we can help each other. You buy my way out of here, and I'll tell you what you want to know. Your fine's been paid, now tell me about Kamatu. Very well. Kamatu is west of Whiterun. It's an unassuming little cave called Swindler's Den. You realize if you set foot in there, you're never coming back out. They'll kill you. But that's your problem, not mine. Guard, my fine's been paid, now set me free. Sorry, my ears aren't so good. You say something? I said my fine has been paid. Now let me out. Right, right. Oh, look at that. I seem to have lost my keys. Might take me a while to find them. You just sit tight. I'll get around to it eventually. Curse you! Uh, okay, then. Roerstedt's a nice enough little hamlet, but a boring... Now I remember. You're the new member of the Companions. So you what? Fetch the mead? No, I go and slay Forsworn. Uh, apparently. Anyway. Swindler's Den. I believe that's between here and Rorikstead, but we may as well go all the way to Rorikstead, see what's going on over there, and then double back for Swindler's Den. Damn those gray mates to oblivion. They want a back to storm. You tried mercenary work? It might suit you. Nope. Sorry. Nothing. Okay, so, to get to Rorikstead, we are going to need to follow the road west, out past this watchtower. There's a lot of dangers along the way, and a lot of detours. I'll point them out along the way, but most of them we're probably going to ignore, if not all of them. If not for time's sake, then for other reasons, such as we'll be directed to go there later. Oh yeah, well, 
I don't care about that stuff, that's why I left it there. Alright, so we can already see the first detour off in the distance. Uh, that big fortress there. I'm going to ignore it for now. We can get some treasure from there, but I believe we get directed to go there a bit later. I can't quite recall. Do you have news of our quarry? the man with the cow. He has nothing to offer us. Let's see. Oh, nothing over there. Not as far as I remember, anyway. There's almost always an encounter with wolves in this part of the road. There's a small detour here. Let's just go up and discover it. North Brittle Shin Pass. We'll be directed to go there for a quest from Falkreef, so don't worry about that right now. Ignore the Dunmer Pilgrim, we already got directions to Azura Shrine from, uh, uh, Bannered Mare. He offers the same quest, it's, don't worry about it. Okay, so this other cave node coming up on our left, I believe, is Bloated Man's Grotto. Yep. Don't go uh, go in there right now. That is a major quest location later in the game. So, also nothing to worry about. likely to be a saber cat around here. But as you can see, we are still on the road to Vorikstead. Saber cat spotted. I think. Yeah. I'm just gonna quick save so I don't have to run back out here. Is it gonna attack? Maybe not. Okay, guess we avoided a fight there. No complaints out of me. To our right here, I believe that area is called Shatterfang Grotto? It's a very small dungeon, about five or six enemies total. Uh, if you were so inclined, you could go here to pick up vampirism, because the enemies here are, you know what, I think we've got time. Broken Fang Cave, okay. I think there is also a dungeon called Shatterfang Grotto, but... 
Uh, yeah, I'll go in and take a peek. See what's up. Now, as a vampire is attacking you, you have a slight chance to pick up Sanguinari Vampiris, the disease that turns into vampirism. Oh, I've forgotten. We are going to need... Uh, let's use Sparks. Vampires resist frost, so bear that in mind. It's worth noting, since I'm playing Skyrim Special Edition and therefore have the Dawn Guard expansion pack, vampires for my game are a little bit different than they will be for uh, vanilla Skyrim. For example, they have vampire armor, which is a class of light armor here, but it's lesser than what I've got currently, or it's equal to my boots, but whatever. I believe it is on par with the leather tier, so... They also uh, have a differing appearance. They have the glowing eyes, fangs, etc. <sighs> Admittedly, I am doing this a bit rushed. It normally shouldn't be this hard, but... I'm trying not to have a two hour long video. Motherfucker. Okay. 50th time is the charm. There we go. I knew you could do it. Alright. Be careful because we have got another vampire, just one more up ahead. He's likely to use necromancy to revive a bandit type enemy, but not necessarily. Holy crap, this guy is terrible. Luckily, we can level up in mid-battle to restore all of our uh, health, magic, and stamina. This particular vampire is a Dunmer, so that partially cancels out the usual weakness to flame. That applies to players as well. If you are playing as a Dunmer, you don't have to worry as much if you become a vampire about mages using... Goodness, Horner, poison. Whoa! I have never seen that animation before. Huh. Okay. That is weird. Whatever the case, we killed him. Now let's go loot that treasure. Uh, is this a skill book? It, yes, it is. Awesome. As is this. Let's 
go ahead and see if we have anything to disenchant. Not for the moment. Alright, let's get the hell out of Dodge. Now, I didn't pick up Sanguinary Vampiris. At least I don't think I did. But that's fine, because we probably don't want to contract vampirism right this minute. It'll be useful later down the line, but not until we're done with a certain plot point. Anyway, let's go ahead and pick up this node over here. This uh, monument, I guess it is, commemorates a centuries old battle. Yep, Yukar's monument. That'll be useful to have for a fast travel point because we get a quest to go there and uh, do something there. Meet someone a bit later. Am I still on the right track? Yeah, yeah. Almost a Rorik's dead. And here we are, Rorikstad itself. It's a very tiny little town, but there's a couple of things we can do here. Maybe not right this minute, though. Let's see here, where might the inn be? Yep, over here. Frost fruit in. My father, Ralki, manages the inn. He used to be a soldier, but he left that life behind. Hey, how's it going? You look like you've seen your share of adventure. I envy you that. In fact, maybe you can help me with something. What is it you're after? I want to be an adventurer like you. My father says I can't. He says he needs me to stay here and work the farm. And even if he did let me be an adventurer, we couldn't afford to buy armor. His name is Mralki, and he's the innkeeper here. I hope you could change his mind. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. I can't stand the thought of being trapped in this village for the rest of my days. This is Eric the Slayer, a potential party member we can recruit. Hmm? He is based off of a Make-A-Wish kid, who has unfortunately already passed away. He's been immortalized and now lives forever within the realm of Skyrim. On that somber note, I think we've spent enough time here for today. So, in the next episode, I'll take on Swindler's Den. <coughs> resolve that quest with the red guard lady and then we will head westward fervor to handle our companions quest but until then i'll see you another time perhaps good night lads and lasses <laughs>